Hey, what's up? I'm AzexM, and before I start this video, I just want to thank Addis Inc. for sending out this pad. They didn't have to, but they did, so thank you, Addis Inc. Now, this is the Neon Pad, a coated, pretty high friction pad that has very substantial stopping power. I've been maining the Heian for about three months now, and I've been playing with this pad for about a week and a half, so I've definitely kind of gotten red pilled into control. I, I used to be like a speed fanatic, I used to only want speed and no stopping power. Now that I'm playing more CS and Valorant, I'm kind of craving that stopping power that I need, especially for lightweight mice like this one that's only 22 grams. It's definitely a necessity for those games with this light of a mouse. I'm not saying that this pad doesn't have any speed though, I think it finds a perfect balance between speed and stopping power, unlike the Heian where it only provides speed and very minimal stopping power that, you know. I don't really want anymore. By no means am I saying this pad is slow, it's not like a muddy pad, it just has pretty ample stopping power. And it is like somewhat fast, but that's strictly because of the coating on it. It is coated, uh, the coating should last you probably six to eight months, that's what I've pretty much read and assumed from Reddit, that's what people are generally saying. So it's gonna last you a pretty decent amount of time and it doesn't feel horrible. A lot of the times with like the inked gaming pad coatings, it'll wear out you know, like really fast, like surprisingly fast, and it doesn't feel the best. With this coating, it doesn't actually feel that bad, and I was pretty impressed by it. The stitched edges on this pad honestly aren't even that bad. They're thicker than most pads that I'm used to, but they're not raised up, and uh, yeah, I can't feel them on my arm when I'm playing. The only thing that I can feel on my arm when I'm playing is this soft fucking pad. Like, geez, this thing is more soft than any pad that I've ever used. Um, not in like terms of squishy. It is squishy. It's four millimeters thick, so it definitely is um, very thick. But the softness on it is like the surface. It's really, really soft, and I'm actually a huge fan of it. And I'm pretty sure this is the softest mouse pad I've ever used. And with that stopping power, you can definitely tell that there's a lot more control with this pad. In terms of control, it's definitely more controly than the Ink Gaming Pad or the GSRC, but those pads had a muddy type of feeling. This one doesn't. It has some type of waterproof technology that uh, makes it water resistant, which also makes it humidity resistant, so this pad is not affected by humidity, which I have tested pretty lengthily. I have a diffuser which increases the humidity in my room, basically puts water in the air, and uh, this pad does not get affected by it whatsoever, so that's a huge plus. The bottom, like, rubber base is pretty OEM. It's got, the, like, that zigzag type, I don't know, base. It sticks well to my desk, but I can obviously move it on the edges. Now, my desk is shit. Look at artisan pads don't stick to it whatsoever, so it's better than an artisan, I'd say, the, in terms of, like, the bottom, but... It's definitely not amazing. In terms of complaints though, that's really my only one. The texture is extremely soft. The stitch edges are very good. The surface is incredibly fucking nice. The coating should hold up a while. And uh, yeah, it's just overall a really good high static friction pad. I'm very happy with it and I really appreciate Addison for sending it out. I think since I play so well with this pad, it's probably gonna be my main for a while. I play really well with control pads and this pad is no exception. I play extremely well with it especially for click timing scenarios, and uh, tracking wasn't horrible either. The surface is so fucking smooth that it makes it so enjoyable to track. It's not like marginally better than like any other pad that I used to track with, but it is very comfortable. Um, I really, really enjoyed this pad. I, I think it's gonna be my main for quite some time, unless some pad comes out of the blue that is very fucking good. Maybe by W Paracords, I'm not sure. Um, if you want this pad, uh, make sure to go to Addisync to buy it. I'll put a link in the description for my affiliate link, I think. I don't know, I'll just throw it in the description. Uh, but yeah, I appreciate it. Thank you for watching my video, and uh, yeah, later.